Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, the top black chick, and we are back with another Bumble Club video. So today, I actually have another thing I want to do today, which is, you know, um, the basic brushes you'll be needing as a beginner, as a makeup lover. You love, you know, you know you, I know you love makeup. You know you love makeup, but you don't want to break the bank. You know, you don't want to go overboard to spend more money, but you still want to have, I mean, what a makeup lover will have to start a makeup thingy or whatever okay so I'm gonna be showing you like the basic brushes you've been needing as a beginner okay you really do not need to break a bank all right the first things first is the spoolie okay this is actually for your eyebrows all right it's either you have this one which is a spoolie or you have this one which is the eyebrow brush okay it has this brush thing it has this brush kind of thing on this part and it has a comb kind of thing on this part so um, it helps you comb and it helps you brush okay that's one brush you need as a beginner okay another brush you'll be needing as a beginner is a foundation brush this can actually serve as, as a concealer brush it can actually serve as a powder brush you really do not need to break a bank to do this okay this is a concealer um, foundation brush but you can use it to do your concealer, set your concealer, do your powder, do your contour. Since it's an angled brush, just make sure that as soon as you're done, you wash it and everything is fine. All right. The next one we're going in is uh, this one is actually a setting brush. It's a concealer brush. It's it's a one a, a thousand and one thing in one. Okay. This is a buffing brush. As you can see, it is really really dense from the looks of things so this brush you can actually use it to set your shadow you can use it to set your eyes with a powder you know all those things you need a brush for to set your face once you're done with um, your concealer and other stuff instead of going back to go and be looking for one powder or one to be looking for one brush you'll be using to set in your face this can actually serve as it okay you can actually get to all those places you you think the other bigger brushes can get to as you can see right now you can use it to set your face too basically what i was saying all right this brush can serve as it that's like how many brushes now three brushes that we are talking about now okay i'm going into a powder brush now you see this powder brush this one here can actually serve so many purposes this can serve as a powder brush. This can serve as a blush brush. As you see, it is really, really fluffy. And if you need a brush, blush brush, you need a fluffy brush. So this can serve as a powder brush. This can serve as a blush brush. This can serve as a contour brush, but it's just that like you're just gonna have to, you know, hold the bristles this way to make sure you get the contoured part very well, okay? So instead of going breaking the bag to go and be buying plenty, plenty brushes, just get this one, it will serve you you know for the right purpose so um, we're going to the eye, eye part now which is for eyeshadows you know I'm gonna suggest this brush two brushes actually you really do not need much two brushes this brush can actually do all the things you want to do for blending for you know blending all your eyeshadows and all that stuff make sure that I'm actually gonna give you the uh, I mean breakdown on how to make do with this brush okay without using another one okay so the first thing you're gonna do if you want to use just this brush if you don't want to break a bank okay but you just want to make sure your makeup is dope everything is looking nice you're gonna start with um, if you want to start on your eye the eye area you're gonna start with the nude colors first okay so you don't mess up the whole thing do you understand Okay, now let's make let's use for it. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna get a palette now. So for instance, now you wanna really you're actually going for like a dramatic look, but you don't have much brushes to create that look. You know, as a for a dramatic look, you have to make sure the your transition color is a nude color. You're gonna start with that first. So the first nude color you're gonna be taking is this one. It depends on your mood though, which is this one here, which is called Atagara. You're gonna go with this one first to do on your crease when you're done with that make sure you dust off the excess product okay before you go into the next product probably you want to go for this one which is marker here okay that's how you get that's how you do till you get the perfect look you don't have to go okay 
I want to start with Marco first. For where I want to put it, before I go into Atagara, it's going to mess up the whole look, okay? My point is, start with the nude colors first before you go into the dark colors, alright? Basically that. The second brush you'll be needing for your eyeshadow is a flat brush. This is a dense flat brush. So it's either you get this kind of brush, which is a dense flat brush, or you get this kind of brush, which is really not dense, but it's flat, which it actually gets to everywhere you want to get to. I think you should get this one because this is like extra, extra, extra. All right. So now let's use this one. This one is a flat brush. This is actually the brush you can you can use to get uh, maybe your shimmery colors when you do cut crease and you really want to get to all those parts a blending brush won't get to that part that's a fact this blending brush i would want to say yeah you can actually use it but no this blending brush will not get to all those parts if you want like a precise a precise cut crease this is the kind of brush you get and you get go into your color any one you want to use like shimmery colors and get there so this is the kind of brush you're going to be needing for an eye look, you just need two brushes basically, which is the blending brush and the flat brush. Okay? Which other one? This is an angled brush here. Yeah? This is an angled flat brush, right? So this brush can actually serve different purposes. Yeah? You can use this brush to create, like if you have like a pot um, gel liner for your eyebrows and all that stuff, you can use this brush to create it. You can use this brush to conceal your brows after you're done with your brows. That if you're done, you can clean the brush with your wipes or anything clean it then go into your concealer and clean your eyes clean your eyebrows all right and another thing you can use this brush is you can use it to create a wing liner a liner not particularly a wing liner you can use it to create any kind of eyeliner okay basically that's what this brush is all about okay so basically these are the brushes you've been needing if you're a beginner okay like i said earlier all these things can actually be done so far you are clean once you're done you clean the brushes for another day so yeah i actually didn't mention one thing you can use this brush for highlight do you understand like this part of the face you can use it to highlight this part of your face which is not a bad thing as well just make sure that you get them cleaned as soon as you're done as soon as as soon as as soon as just make sure you get them clean as soon as you're done okay that's basically about the basic brushes basically about the basic brushes they learn how far so that's basically about the brushes you've been needing as a beginner okay if you enjoyed this video do not forget to hit the like button okay give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you haven't subscribed yet i don't know what you're waiting for just hit the subscribe button okay and we're good all right yeah that's basically about it all right i'll see you guys on my next one bye